Um, I hope the lighting is better this time because I did invest in a, well, my husband invested in a ring light for me uh, for my birthday, so I am using that for the very first time tonight, and I'm so excited. So I hope you guys can see me a little bit better, <clears throat> but it's going to take me a minute to kind of play with the, the lighting and see what works best. So um, let's go ahead and jump right into it. This is a Ipsy unbagging. I just received this today and I have been dying to open it up, but of course I waited for a camera. So, uh, let's see. Urgh. What do we have here? Oh, okay. Um, not <laughs> the stuff is coming out of the bag well not coming out of the bag it came out of the bag so I guess there is no surprise to these let's just go ahead and open these up uh, the first one I received is the bye bye pores pressed airbrush silk pressed anti-aging finishing powder Whew, that was a mouthful um, if you heard that that's my dog grunting <laughs> um, okay so say says it's airbrushing in a powder, blurs imperfections for a flawless finish, anti-aging with silk, collagen, and antioxidants. Always love anti-aging, period. Um, universal translucent shade for all skin tones. So it is translucent. Okay. Um, that would be really nice if it really did make my pores disappear. So it does say that it's cruelty free. So I'm opening it up. It gives me a little, little <coughs> gives me a little puff. Not that I'll be using it, but come out, come out. Oh, okay. This little plastic piece is going to be hard and not come out. And I don't want to dig my finger in there. Oh, of course, it's going to be difficult, right? Oh, there we go. <laughs> so. Oh, oh, that is really, really soft. Let's see if it does anything. All right, so it feels really good on the skin. Really, really soft. I like that. Um, oh, kind of has a funky smell to it. Not in the in the pan, but on my hand has a little funky smell so I don't know I will definitely um, I'll test that out see if I like it or not um, okay so the next thing that we have outside of the bag is a Urban Decay 24-7 glide on pencil in perversion okay what color did we get which is black perversion is black apparently there are 41 shades I would have liked to have gotten a different color to play with but you know at least I still get to test it out considering I haven't used it before so that'll be fun um, it's, a, ooh, it's a good size little sample so I actually I like that um, it is more like a crayon Ooh, that is very very creamy and it's deep black you see that just a solid black so oh that'll be nice that'll be nice for my waterline oh and it says it's waterproof creamy award-winning waterproof okay so I'm really excited about this now now that I know that it's waterproof so I cannot wait to use that I've been wanting to do a smoky eye and I just I keep playing with it haven't really gotten to it yet but I will definitely be using that so uh, let's see. Oh, I get two more masks. I got two masks last time. Uh, this time they sent me two masks as well. It is the Bio Republic Skin Care. This is the Pomegranate Crush Illuminating Fiber Sheet Mask with Vitamin E for all skin types. And then this one is the Cucumber Breeze Smoothing, I'm sorry, Cucumber Breeze Soothing Fiber Sheet Mask with Vitamin E for all skin types. All right. So this is what they look like here. Let's see. 
So this one says that it's infused with natural pomegranate extract and vitamin E. This one brightens and energizes skin tone, evens and smooths complexion for radiant, fresh, and balanced skin. Nice. Uh, the cucumber, of course, is infused with natural cucumber and vitamin E. It soothes stressed skin and improves complexion. Girl, I am stressed all the time, so that would be great. Um, tightens pores and reduces appearances of fine lines for calm, rejuvenated, spring fresh skin. A biodegradable fiber mask that snugly fits the contours of your face, ensuring optimal delivery of vital nutrients to the skin. Okay. Sounds great. I can't wait to try these. So that is the two masks that I got, cucumber and pomegranate. All right. So now that we have gotten to those, what is that? Three items that were outside of the bag. Let's go and see what else is in the bag. Um, this is the bag this month. It actually is really cute. It's got this um, kind of like lace texture to it. Uh, with the flowers on top. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is so freaking cute because it's October. I don't know if you can see that. Um, it has a little bat on <laughs> that is a cute touch. And it says, of course, it says Ipsy. So I like that. That's cute that they threw that in for October. All right. So um, what is this? Essence. Here it is. Uh, it is a satin touch blush. It's a pretty color. Um, I have never tried anything from them before. It says it's, uh, let's see, for, good for 12 months. Satin soft blush for a fresh looking complexion all day long. Satin coral. So I guess it's the number 10 is satin coral. Um, let's see. Oh, goodness gracious, that is bright. That is bright. Let's see if I can do another swatch and let you guys see it a little bit better. All right. Can you see that? That is just really, really, really bright. That is a bright pink. Ah, I don't know how that, if that would work for me or not. I don't know if that's necessarily my cup of tea. I do like the design in it though. I think that is actually really creative. Um, so I do appreciate that factor. I will just have to see what this looks like on my skin. It is pigmented. It feels really soft to the touch. Um, so I'm interested to see how it will work. Um, the color is debatable. <laughs> the color is definitely debatable. So all right what else do we have going back in the bag something round what is this meech and mia um meech and mia i've never heard of that m&m <laughs> m&m shadows um in the color beige i don't know this is something i've never heard of before so What in the world? Okay. Okay, so this looks like it is a loose powder. Um, I'm guessing it's an eyeshadow. Not really sure. Um, I had to break the seal with a, a, a scissors because I cannot get this top part off. All right, so I am not happy with this one. I, I the color is kind of pretty but you can't even tell that it's there you really have to can you see that I don't know if you can but I can barely see it right here in person so um, that one is that's a flop I don't I don't like that I don't, yeah, that one sucks. All right, so the list we have is a card, and it says, in my defense, the moon was full, and I was left unsupervised. 
I like that. That's cute. Um, spellbound. The leaves have turned. The air is cooler. Nightfall starts a little sooner each day. Everything feels enchanted, myster mysterious, and different. We're so bewitched by this eerie time of year and all the change it brings that we're embracing our own transformations too. Swing by ipsy.com for ideas on easy ways to switch things up, plus everything you need to know about your October glam bag picks. So, that's it. I only had two items that were actually in the bag. So, not much of a surprise, considering you open it up and there's your stuff. So let's just recap really fast. Um, we got the... We got the face mask, which I love. I, I love face masks, so I'm really excited about this. Um, we got the waterproof um, eye pencil from Urban Decay. I'm excited about that. Um, we have the Bye Bye uh, Pores Press Translucent Powder, so I'm eager to try this to see if this really works. I know it kind of had a funky smell to it. Smells gone. Smell is gone, so um, that's something I am interested in trying. I was never really interested in trying this brand, um, but it really applied really nicely. It felt really good to the touch. Um, the color is a little iffy, but we will definitely test this out and see how this works. Um, the Mia and Meech, I guess this is eyeshadow. This just totally sucks. Um, I'm definitely not happy with this. The color would have been pretty if it was to show up, um, maybe it would be good for a topper, but I am just not a loose powder kind of girl. Um, but all in all, I will have to say that I did enjoy this month. Um, you know, my four out of five items were a hit for me. The bag is, they nailed it out of the park with this bag for October. I love the little bag. That's so cute. Um, and especially considering that this actually is my birthday month. So I really enjoy this right here so once again i will be continuing my subscription hopefully um, next month will be as good if not better so if you did like this video do not forget to hit the thumbs up make sure you hit the subscribe button down below as well you can follow me on instagram and i will have that link down below and i will see you guys on my next video bye